Hello, welcome to South Channel. This is King. Welcome back. Today, I'm going to introduce our newest release product, Inside V2. As compact as other models like G2, this up-to-date model additionally equips with a camera to realize AR stakeout. Traditional stakeout uses a guideline on the maps and three arrows to point the direction. It could be simple for experienced surveyors, but it may confuse novice. AR stakeout makes up this gap. Beginners and or veterans can directly follow what they see on the screen to reach the target. Benefiting from this, users can save more time on stakeout and be less confused about the direction. Before we start, please take a look in the following checklist. We need to have an Insight V2, a H6 data controller, at least one available SIM card, and a software SurfStar installed on H6. All right, now we get everything prepared. Let's start. First, turn on all the devices and run self start. Go to communication and select communication mode as WLAN. Choose the correct device and connect. In this step, please make sure the receiver WLAN setting is AP mode in order to pair with H6. Second, go to Device, Rover, Data Link mode, and select Bluetooth. Notice, do not choose receiver Wi Fi, otherwise, the WLAN setting will change to client and you need to set it on Web UI or set it to factory default. Add a cost account and obtain correction data to get fixed solution. Make sure the direction of the RDK camera is consistent with the H6. Third, go to Survey, Point Stakeout, and select a point. Initiate to Survey. Please remember to initiate two surveys or you cannot turn on AR. Click AR button. When we get close enough, the camera is available. Default setting is 10 meters away from the target point. You can customize the distance, follow the guidance in H6, and you can easily stake out the point. Instead of this point, you can also check on other points stored in H6. AR Stakeout is extraordinary, isn't it? If you are interested in this model or have any confusions, feel free to contact us. Don't forget to follow our channels for the latest news. See you next time. Bye-bye.